All right, hey, we're here with Jack at HP Logic. What up? And uh, we're gonna dyno the Tesla Model 3. I can't say we're the first, because I actually did see one get dynoed yesterday, but I wasn't quite sure about the results. They said it put down 400 horsepower to the wheels. I don't think it's gonna do that. What do you think? I don't think so. Nah, I mean, the P85 does 400, and that yeah. thing runs low 12s in the quarter mile. What are you thinking, Dan? Time will tell, man. What's the number? What's the number? Uh, Give us a number. I'd say uh, 397. 397. <laughs> no way. What's I'm your gonna, guess? I'm going to go with uh, 335. 335. Yeah. yeah, I'm thinking low threes too. Yeah. I'm actually going to say 290. 290. 290 to the wheels. The way 290. The your dyno is it's terrible on wheel nice. drive cars too. It's not nice. But here's the thing we have dyno results from my P90, or no, no, my P85D as well as uh, the P100D, which we got right here. Yeah. So at least we'll be able to get a good comparison of what these cars and that car makes instead of just some dyno result that you don't really have anything to compare it to. This, so, uh, this is like their like Econo box, basically, right? Yes. So so this well, thing... This is the it, base model with the big battery. Right. right? right. right. So it's not yeah. cheap. comes yeah. in at, what, $50,000? 50, $50, yeah. So it's still... It's not out there, but it's definitely... You know, it's not, it's not, yeah. the, not the most yeah. expensive Yeah, we V-boxed it. It ran uh, 13.3 at uh, 103 miles an hour. We're actually taking it to the track this weekend at Palm Beach and Arasana Race. And I think Jack's coming out too with a special car we'll try. for a race. We'll try. If so, I got time, I'll, I'll, I'll definitely What if out. we do Ferrari 348? Is that what it is? 348. Ferrari 348 versus Tesla Model 3. Top of the heat versus the bottom of the heat. I right? don't know. It's Ferrari. It and everyone loves Ferrari and everyone loves Tesla. So I can't I lose. It's a Ferrari. I exactly, can't lose. Exactly. Exactly. I can't so. lose. I'm not going to lose to a Tesla freaking <laughs> battery car. Mm. That doesn't happen. You have to shift. You have to shift. <laughs> you, see uh, this? And Dan, see this? Dan's just going to mash on the, on the accelerator. You, just can, let's talk about That's this for exactly. a second. Let's talk about this. What, what are we looking at? This is what the Germans were studying yeah. for the uh, PDK. <laughs> okay? I just want to put that out there. The guns? No, just the mechanism. All right. <laughs> well, let's get started. We're here. We're going to load up the Tesla Model 3 on the dyno. And let's, uh, so I say 295, we got 320, and he's going for 400. Let's load up and see what it does. Let's go. Very quiet. There's a Tesla. I don't hear anything. Is it on? Are they ever, are they ever off? Are they ever off? No, they're not really off. You're making too much noise. <laughs> we'll leave it in reverse. <laughs> All right, so last time when we dynoed the P100D, it gave us trouble on the dyno. And I remember when we did, we had to basically. We had like to trick it or something. Yeah, so we take, we turn traction control off or a slip start, and then we have to run it up to like 80 miles an hour, remember? Yep. And all the error all codes the came up, Boom. and then we brought it back down to zero, and yeah. then we stabbed it. Yeah. So now you were worried about the P100 breaking the dyno. Right. But this one. Not so worried. Fine. Not so so we can run it from. So worried. from Watch now. it breaks it. Yeah. <laughs> So what do we got? We got nowhere to tie it down. They did not make this car dyno friendly. Aerodynamic. It's not very. It, it, it is very aerodynamic. It is very not dyno dynamic. Uh. No. All right. No. <laughs> All right. Tesla's strapped down. Dyno videos are not that exciting, so. I mean, I don't know. There's really not much to do. You want me to go get some confetti? Yeah. And throw it? I like, mean, 300. Oof. Whatever. You're going to see it run on the dyno, and we'll get some numbers. Tesla Model 3 dyno. Very quiet. Okay, so the control is kicking right now. It is? Yep. You can't go any faster? No. Because the front wheel's not rolling. That took forever. <laughs> that was way longer than six seconds. That was only a hundred. What? That was only a hundred. That was a hundred miles an hour. Calculation. Okay. All right, so we ran the Power Tools app on the iPhone, which pulls the kilowatt, just kilowatts. And that's 147. 
And you multiply that times 1.3, right? I think so, yeah. Roughly? Okay. And that's 191. 191. And let's see what the dyno got. You guys are fucking with me. <laughs> 191. So 200 horsepower to the wheels. Where did you, what? There's some gypsy magic going on here. Well, the, star well, the bet was the closest without going over. So we all you, went So over. you won. Well, so I, I guess I was the closest. I said 280, 90. <laughs> I am curious though. I wonder if it was actually giving us full power. I actually expected more than that. Yeah, it yeah. was weird because you if, know? You look, if you look at the dyno graph, it was actually rising. Let me. Uh, and then it stopped. I'll work on this graph a little bit okay. to try and make it more presentable. But from what I'm looking at right now, it definitely looks like it lost power and then gave it back up gotcha. top, which would. Well, we'll what we can definitely why. do is we can run that tool again well, to explain on the street why it took so long and see if it does that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it took a long time. To okay. Get to All right, we're gonna try one more time. All right, so we're gonna give it another try. We disconnected the front right ABS sensor from this car. I'm not gonna take credit for that. I found that information in the forums. We disconnected the front. We're gonna try and do a dyno with just the rear this time and see what it makes. All right, take three. Dyno, model three. Action! Better? Yep. All right. Ready? Go! We got it to dyno in uh, rear wheel drive, disconnecting the ABS sensor on the front. I lost. What did I say? I said 285, 290. You said 390. Jack? 320. 320, and it came in at 327, 250 something kilowatts. Let's see what the dyno shows. Where's my shirt? Actual, yeah, you get a shirt. <laughs> All right, so third time's a charm. We got the results here. Lots of torque. Typical Tesla dyno graph where it makes a lot of torque. You can see this. Torque right here, that is 552 foot-pounds of torque to the wheels. Horsepower, 281, I guess 290. He said 320. Dan said 400, 390. I'm, I'm way off I'm over an here. I was optimistic. I'm an optimist. So <laughs> I think these results are pretty in line with what the car, how the car, car performs on the V-Box. Look, look, the, the, the power tool said I won. Right. The power dyno, tools did show 250 kilowatts. The dyno says you won. Yeah. So you're cutting a shirt in half, yeah. buddy. So 250 right there times 1.34 is what? Horsepower. Is. Yeah, what is the number? Insert music, math music. 336. 336. So the car I think it's making 336. The dyno's measuring 280. We're, maybe we could bring up my P100D. All right, so we just brought up the Tesla, my Tesla P100D that we dynoed, I don't know, a year or so ago. And you can see in the graph here, what do we got? Tell us what it is, Jack. We peaked at about 587 to the wheel. Okay. Up in, in the, uh, but, but we also did like a, a kind of a ramp up run with your car. So yeah, we didn't want to break the dyno. Exactly. Which so we started later in the RPMs. Yeah. But as you can see, obviously the, pet, the, the P100 makes a lot more power. Yeah, uh, huge, huge difference, yeah, yeah. you know, in the graph. And but at the end of the day, the Tesla Model 3, 552 foot-pounds of torque, 281 horsepower to the wheels. And that's it for the dyno results. We are going to, hopefully, Jack is going to bring out the Ferrari. Nah, after seeing that, I'm and done. We, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> Did you dine on the Ferrari? No. Never even dine on the Ferrari. So you definitely not bring it out. You might bring it out. I, I, we might. We'll you might see. bring it out. Let's All see. Right. Let's we'll see how the day goes. I think we need to see Tesla Model Three versus Ferrari Three. If you guys want to see that, let them know in the comments. Yeah. Hopefully, I'll get this video up in time so we can see that too. Yeah. Exactly. All right. So there you go. We got Tesla Model Three on the dyno. Thanks to Jack at Horsepower Logic for putting us up today. Thanks for Dan, Florida Drilling, for bringing out the car today. Subscribe for more. We got some good races coming this weekend. We're gonna have Trackhawk versus Tesla Model X P100D. I got the McLaren 720S coming out with another McLaren that's tuned. 
some other Teslas and some other fast cars. So we'll get those races up soon. Thanks for watching.